Alright, so today I'll be reading Harry the Dirty Dog. Right. Harry the D Dirty Dog by Jean Zion. Harry was a white dog with black spots who liked everything except getting a bath. So one day he heard the water running in the tub. He took the scrubbing brush. buried it in the backyard. Then he ran away from home. Oh, that's very sad. He should never run away from home. He played where they were fixing the street and got very dirty. Then he played at the railroad and got even dirtier. He played tag with other dogs and became dirtier still. That's one dirty dog. He slid down a coal chute and got the dirtiest of all. In fact, he changed from a, right, from a white dog with black spots to a black dog with white spots. Although he, there were many other uh, things to do, Harry began to wonder if his family thought he had really ran away. He felt tired and hungry too. So without stopping on the way, he ran back home. When Harry got to his house, he crawled through the fence and sat looking at the door. One of the family looked out and said, there was a strange dog in our backyard. By the way, has anyone seen Harry? See, they can't recognize him. Harry heard this. He tried very hard to show him that he was Harry. He started to do all his old clever tricks. He flip-flopped and flop-flipped and rolled over and played dead. He's doing all his doggy tricks there. He danced and he sang. He did these tricks over and over again. But everyone shook their heads and said, Oh no, it couldn't be Harry. Harry gave up and walked away slowly towards the gate. But suddenly he stopped. He ran to the corner of the garden and started to dig furiously. Soon he jumped away from the hole, barking short, happy barks. He found the brush. He found the scrubbing brush and carried it in his mouth. He ran to the house. But up the stairs he dashed, with the family following close behind. Harry's bath was the soapiest one he'd ever had. It worked like magic. As soon as the children started to scrub, they began shouting, Mommy, Daddy, come quick, look. It's Harry, it's Harry, it's ha Harry, they cried. Harry wagged his tail and was very, very happy. The family combed and brushed him lovingly, and he became once again the white dog with black spots. It was wonderful to be home. After dinner, Harry fell asleep. It was his favorite place, happily dreaming about how fun it had been getting dirty. He slept so soundly he didn't even feel the scrubbing brush he had hid under his pillow. So he went and he hid it again. Hope he doesn't get in trouble. The end.